That's no ordinary meteorite. What's going on? We made it. Wait up. cocoon it's not there well you're looking at a different time that's the world I come from in my world cocoon doesn't exist when I was born the sky was already empty <sighs> tell me how many years has it been since Ragnarok appeared and cocoon fell well it's 3 a.f. so that was three years ago for me all that happened 700 years in the past. I was born and raised in another time. 700 years in the future. Yes, I knew it. I knew you weren't from this world. I'm the last of humanity. Hey! <sighs> Sarah, I can take you there. We can find <laughs> lightning together. I know she wants to see you. You're full of it! Yeah, that's impossible! Lightning's gone, man. I don't. <sighs> Noel, do you know where my sister is? Come with me. Time gate. What do you mean? Wow. Time gate. What the? It's like a portal. Lightning is in a place oh. called Valhalla. She's waiting on the other oh. side. I couldn't turn my eyes away. I knew the answer lay beyond that gate. The answer to my doubts and dreams. Oh. On the broad plain beneath Cocoon, my sister once celebrated my marriage to Snow. I remember her smile like it was yesterday. But sometime, when I wasn't looking, she disappeared. She was gone as if she'd never been there in the first place. Lightning, are you out there? Did I dream that day on Pulse, or did it really happen? Noel says he can find you, but is he telling the truth? Noel's world was a terrible place where Cocoon did not exist. He had traveled back in time to change that bleak future. Or so he told us. Listen, when different eras overlap, all kinds of crazy stuff happens. Objects from different times get mixed up. If you want to open a gate and travel through time, you have to find one of those objects. They're called artifacts. Uh, artifacts? The keys to the future. Hmm. They're anachronisms, relics of a different world. Basically, things that don't belong in your time. If we can find one, we might be able to use it to open the gate. Then we could cross time and travel to Lightning's world. Hmm. <sighs> could Noel be telling the truth? Beyond that gate, in a place called Valhalla, is Lightning alive and waiting for me? Can I dare to hope again, after all this time? Oh, how I want to believe. I want my sister back. So much happened the night the meteorite fell. We all had a lot to think about. I wonder if anyone slept. <sighs> Good morning.
going to you. You slept okay, Ben? Your new friend talked a lot about lightning. I kind of figured you'd be tossing and turning all night. I don't think my sister would want me moping around. You were up late last night, Mackie. Big project? P project Yeah, I, I was, uh, working on something for Snow. That thing, y you know. <laughs> So, you're just taking him at his word? He's... I guess you're right. It's just hard after I had that dream about lightning. You know what I mean? Hey, Sarah. Listen, what's the deal with you and that Noel guy, anyway? If I said I was going with him, would you stop me? Let you run off with some con artist? I'd beat him half to death first. Outside once you're ready, okay? Sarah, wait up for me. All this talk about artifacts and gates and time travel, to be honest, I don't know if I'm ready to believe it. Sarah, there's still so much I don't understand myself. If we can actually find an artifact, then I'll know what I've been saying is true. And once we open the gate, you'll be able to put some of your doubts to rest as well. So what do you think? Will you search for the answers with me? <sighs> Give me a chance and I'll prove that it's true. Hey there, Sarah. Sorry, but I'm not letting anyone near that meteorite just yet. All right, then. Hey, Godot. What do you think those artifact things are? You know, the keys Noel was talking about. How should I know? Even if I did, I wouldn't tell you. So, you do know something? No, I got no idea. You're not actually swallowing any of that crap, are you? I have to give him a chance, at least. Is that the artifact? This is Lightning's knife. I keep it in my room, but how did it get out here? Hey, look there. <laughs> Snow! <Sarah! laughs> <laughs> Come on. Okay. <laughs> it's her knife. I found it near the base of the pillar. Sorry. She must be inside the pillar. Lightning's holding up Cocoon. Along with the Neil and Flame. Wait, what are you talking about? She was right here a second ago. I saw her. We talked. She gave us her blessing. Snow and I were getting married. She laughed and said congrats. But then, all of a sudden, lightning disappeared. She was gone, like she was never there to begin with. No one else remembered her smiling and laughing. No one.
but me. All your friends think your sister is inside that pillar. I was scared. People said I was dreaming. They said... They said I was just making up stories so that I didn't have to face the truth. Listen, Sarah. Your memories are the truth. Lightning is alive. The question is, why are you the only one who remembers? Well... Perhaps history changed somehow. You mean, your memories are true, but history was altered afterwards? Of course, that's not really possible. I know that. But I just don't understand how I can remember it so clearly when no one else can. Weird. The knife looks like it's been polished.